I'm new to social media. What platform should I start with? So I think you should be on all the platforms. So I'm gonna first start with that. I'm gonna say, but, and the big but is, I think you need to be consistent with a single platform to win. The problem is, is what you're going to do is you're going to go on Snapchat and you're gonna go on Instagram and you're gonna go on Twitter and Facebook and you're gonna do one thing consistent for a week and then guess what happened? You're gonna be on social media overload because guess what? You have to put out fires on this escrow. You have to help out this client here and you're too busy. What I would tell you is to start with one platform, right? Right? Let's start with one and let's get consistent. So for me, if I'm a realtor, I'm starting with Facebook, right? And I'm really putting a lot of eggs in that Facebook basket for now. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to be consistent. I'm going to be posting on it once a week and I'm going to be posting some relevant information. I'm going to be doing a Facebook Live once a week and I'm going to be doing something interesting that my audience can relate with. I'm going to be doing those things and once I get through five, six, seven weeks and I'm consistent, then I'm going to say, now how do I do micro content maybe with an Instagram? And I'm going to now get consistent with Instagram. And then I'm going to say, great, once I'm consistent with those two and I've been going months and months and months, now I'm going to look at um, Snapchat or Twitter. and so. I would say you need to be on all of them, but I find that real tours are never consistent on all platforms. There are some out there, so I'm not hitting all of you, but the majority of you and I watch are not consistent on all platforms. So I would say start with one, whatever fits your audience. If you're a millennial and you're a real tour, go where your people are, my friends, right? Go to Snapchat, go to the Instagram. If you're you know, going out for families, the majority of families um, and, and, and folks from the age of you know, 35 and plus are probably gonna be on Facebook. So I, I think you have to know where your audience is, number one, pick that platform, number two, be consistent with it, and then start to look for micro content, um, social media platforms to, to, to then go into. I mean, uh, there, there's, a, there's a lot of social media platforms. I think the biggest problem is you're not being consistent. And I've said that probably five times, maybe we can count that, and it's just, it's true. We have to stay and be consistent in this world.